Here's another project I'm working on in the Starver Shark Egg Room here. You can see it. So I had a kind of a flower shop type looking shelf here, which I sold on uh, Facebook Marketplace. And then I had sort of a metal shelf here that was ever only supposed to be temporary and it's probably been there for like 10 years. So I went to Ikea and I bought a couple shelves. I bought a Billy shelf and then I think I could have bought another one to fit right in there, but I ended up buying a smaller one, which is okay because I'll have some space back there in the corner where you'll be able to I'll be able to hang some stuff on the wall. Um, but I've been really trying to pare down the newer strawberry shortcake stuff that I have. And so a lot of that is going on my eBay store. And this stuff right now I've decided I'm keeping, although I'm not 100% on all of it. In fact, I'm looking at a couple of things right now and going, nah, I could let that go. Um, and so I want to put all of, and I have a lot more than this too. I've got a bunch of dolls and stuff that are in bags when I was taking everything down. But I want to put all of that stuff on the smaller shelf that's going to go against this wall. And then spread out some of my vintage stuff that kind of is sitting on the floor and stuff now. And kind of make that look a little bit nicer. So another step towards making the strawberry shortcake room look nicer. I did that there. I did all the folding of the fabric here, which is encumbered by stuff right now. I did this little project. So just keeping it rolling. Okay. I said I was going to show you guys progress as I put the shelves up. So I got this other shelf up. It's quite a bit smaller. I was hoping for whatever crazy reason, that I would be able to fit all my new strawberry, stu strawberry shortcake stuff on this shelf. But as you can see, that's just not going to happen. So I had already organized a bunch of it, and then I had to move it, and then I had to move everything again, and then I had to move everything again. So here's what I have so far. Now, obviously, I'm wasting a bunch of space up here, so I'm not sure how this is going to go yet, but... Um, I like seeing the front of the castle. I couldn't put the top section up there, but you can kind of see it. But then the doors open and you can peekaboo in and you can see strawberry shortcake sitting at the piano with custard and the candelabra there. And then I have another strawberry and huckleberry at the um, horse and carriage. And then another princess strawberry doll up there. Down here. This is, I think, temporary. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this stuff yet. But this is the that um, the set with the hammock and the little bar. And uh, I haven't put the, any accessories out yet because everything's not certain yet. But there's like little drinks and stuff like that that goes with this. This, I think, is pretty much how it's going to be. I've got these dolls here. And I kind of moved these ones out a little bit. So there's a little ledge so I could fit some of the little figures and stuff I have up there. And then I've got some dolls out of their boxes that are sitting here. And I've got quite a few dolls and stuff listed on my eBay store if you want to go over there. Well, I also have kind of this open wall space back here. So I hung up some of the stuff that was on my other wall. The hooks and the shelves. This is not what's staying on the shelves. A lot of these have hair rot too, these little dolls. And then I have these shelves that are they're really cute on the sides. But you can't see the sides from the front, so it's kind of silly. That paint should be on the inside, not on the outside. Oh, well. Okay, here is the, I was going to say final, but maybe like semi-final product of what the shelf is going to look like. Pretty much everything on this shelf has been moved at least two or three times. But... I think it's pretty much going to stay how it is right now. 
put my VHS tapes up here. I have a little space here and I've got some more stuff. So they'll probably get some more stuff there. These are vending stickers, different iterations. This is a shiny one and these are kind of sort of dress up -y style ones. I really like those, but I feel like I'll never be able to find the whole set of them. <laughs> and then I have strawberry and huckleberry here in the horse and carriage. Huckleberry, of course, is the carriage driver there. And then I have the strawberry castle. I don't have the top piece on it, which you could take it off or put it on and it just took up too much space on the shelf, so it's off. But I did want to show you. So here I have Huckleberry sitting on the steps. And if you notice his little, this little red band on him, I actually just put a rubber band, like one of those tiny little rubber bands around to keep him there. I should have used a clear one, but red was what I had in here. And then if you look in the window, I have a little vignette of strawberry shortcake there sitting on a chair, also with one of those little rubber bands because that's the only way she'll stay in the chair. <laughs> those little rubber bands are really good for keeping things in hands or keeping dolls in place. They work really well. Um, and there's a little candelabra and a little clock up there. And then custard sitting on the stairs. And then if we come down to the next shelf here, I have just a couple of the Playmates dolls. I really like the sets with the littler girls, like the babies. They're not, they're not really depicted as babies and Playmates, but this is Strawberry Shortcake and Apple Dumplin', the Sweet Sleepover set. So they have a little bunk bed here with pillows and all kinds of little accessories. And then this is a Berry Ballet set. So it has... Crepe Suzette and Cherry Cuddler. And they're like in a ballet studio. You can kind of see their little accessories back there. And those are the only two iterations I have of either of those dolls from any of the newer doll series. So I thought that was a pretty neat set. And then I have these little PVCs here. And then back here, I've got Princess and the Bride. And then some Berry Giggle Friends where she's a princess. And then this one is Angel Cake. And there's an open space here, which I think this robe was actually attached there. And I had opened her up and put it on her, I guess, at some point. So I think that's what's missing there. We've got Strawberry as a cheerleader. This is a little sort of tropical bar set. It had a little hammock with palm trees, and this is like a little lounge chair and a little umbrella, and it even has little drinks that came with the set. And then I just added the cocoa in the pot there and custard sitting there with them. And then moving down here, I've got a very special parties set that has strawberry and custard and a bunch of like little Christmassy stuff. She's having a Christmas party. See the tree in the background there? I have the box from this special edition doll. I actually took her out of the box because she's too cute not to display. And then a few more sets back here. Another strawberry and apple. Another strawberry and apple. And another strawberry and apple there. <laughs> I actually have some of the Valentine card sets up here. And some sunglasses. There's some more Valentine card sets up there. And then a bunch of the dolls here with their pets. Orange and angel cake and strawberry and... Huckleberry pie, ginger snap. I always want to call her Cafe Olay, but she's ginger snap now. 
and then a couple of mini versions of those. And then when we move down here, I have another house, a regular house. And if we look inside, there's a little vignette. Strawberry sitting there watching TV with some cookies and custard. She's sitting in her little rocking chair. There's Honey Pie Pony sneaking back there. I've got a couple of dolls against the wall there. And then the dollhouse furniture. So there's the bedroom set there. You can kind of see it. And the living room set. I was going to film this before I put the dolls on it, but they're there now. <laughs> and again, like Strawberry is sitting with a rubber band around her waist to keep her in that chair. Now down below here, I got some other of the Playmate sets. I really liked the sets where they had the little vehicles. And then I also got the little berry babies. I think their faces are kind of ugly, but <laughs> but they're cute. I have some little PVC figures here and some of the accessories. And then down on my furthest bottom shelf, I've got a whole little display case there of the plushies. Some of the ballerina ones, some of the pet ones, a couple of art kits, a purse, some shoes, a playground ball, some of the random stuff that I wanted to keep. That is a little trash can and inside is the um, shower curtain and shower curtain rings, some little bags. This area over here is incomplete right now because I've got some more stuff to put over here, but I'll show you anyway. I had some of the little shelves. So I put things on the shelves. You can kind of see on the edge of the shelves there. They're cute little strawberry shelves. Some of the little makeup sets. So, like I said, still a work in progress, but, and then my strawberry skull that I got at Target this year is up there, and the strawberry shortcake rolls. So that's where we're at now. This was, if you've seen pictures before, um, I had a like flower shop looking shelf here, which it was really cute with the strawberry shortcake stuff, but it just took up too much space. And then I had a lot of this stuff on the shelf over here, which this shelf clearly is not done. Everything's a work in progress, you know, <laughs> but I had all of the newer stuff on both of these two shelves. So I, I pared it down to this shelf and believe it or not, this is after getting rid of a whole bunch of stuff. So if you're interested in the newer strawberry shortcake stuff, I've got a lot of it on my eBay store right now. Link in the description down below. Okay, guys, let me know how you think that I did. And um, thanks for watching. Make sure to comment down below. Like the video, give it a thumbs up, and subscribe if you haven't subscribed. We've got lots of fun strawberry shortcake videos. And if you get a chance, please watch one of the commercials. Thanks. Bye.